So good morning. I'm Tom Hugh, president of the Freedom Museum, located here in Manassas at the Manassas Regional Airport. So next week, we're going to be participating in the Manassas History Weekend, August 24th through 26th, over at the Manassas Museum and the uh, Liberia House. A lot of unique items. Uh, our, our crown jewel, I would say, is our uh, uh, the nose section of a B-25 bomber, uh, dating back from World War II. Uh, we'll also be bringing a, uh, an ambulance. It was uh, one of the props used in the movie MASH, so it represents the Korean War era. And we have a Vietnam era Jeep. We'll have some other displays, uh, things from the museum that uh, are a little more portable, uh, you know, so we can uh, uh, show them off to the people who come to visit uh, uh, Manassas History Weekend. It has been around since 1999. Uh, it's been located here at the Manassas Regional Airport Terminal. Uh, we have expanded over the years and we are starting to look for, uh, for a new place to, to settle in. So uh, we have a lot of uh, artifacts that uh, are from the local community. Uh, members and their family members who served from the Spanish-American War in 1898 all the way up to the present day. Uh, I'm standing here in front of our, our wall of local heroes, and we have 162 names on the wall, uh, men and women whom we honor for giving the ultimate sacrifice to their country. Uh, October 20th, uh, that's a Saturday evening, we have uh, our annual hangar dance gala event. We're gonna have, uh, it's set up kinda like a World War II uh, we can't actually have it in a hangar, but we'll have an event tent, we'll have break catering, we have a swing band. We even have a swing band instructor, so uh, if, if you're a little worried about uh, not being able to keep up, uh, we can give you a few lessons. Previous to that, on Monday, October 15th, we'll be having our annual golf tournament, this year in conjunction with the Virginia Air Search and Rescue Service, being held at the Stonewall Golf Club. Uh, we'll also have a B-17 coming in, from uh, the EAA, that's the Experimental Aircraft Association, Chapter 186, located across the runway from the airport terminal. Uh, they'll be flying the B-17 aluminum overcast, should be arriving here at the airport on October 18th and staying through October 21st. So it's a big week for, uh, for a lot of local folks and uh, it's all centering around the, the, uh, the Freedom Museum. So hope you can join us.